W H E A T. Wheat. Yeah, hey yo, it's me, myself. I'm not going to be talking about an amazing, unique plant. I'm going to be talking about an amazing plant provider that the world calls wheat. Work if it doesn't, I'll be cool. Even if for now I only manage to scrape by. Wheat has been grown since the start of European settlement in around the 1800s within Australia. About to have fun and not think about this life because we only have Australia one. is the biggest distributor of agricultural plants, but the biggest product is wheat, or also known as a cereal crop. Wheat is our most important grain crop and is the main ingredient in such foods as bread, pastry and pasta. After we are depleted of carbohydrates, our body switches over to another fuel source like protein for example. Excess carbohydrates that aren't used are stored as fats, which our body can use later. Scientific research is looking into a new way to manufacture wheat that is able to grow all throughout the year instead of having a winter and spring wheat, which makes my life hard for cereal farmers like myself. Because our economy relies on wheat so much, cereal farmers have to keep up with supplies. 80% of exports are sold overseas due to the high need. The importance of wheat to the world is not only for human benefits. Animals also need the wheat to survive. Some of these animals are cows, sheep, goats and horses. But the wheat being in one of the biggest industries, meat is right up there with it. With the loss of the wheat industry, the livestock industry would then become in great danger. Losing the wheat industry, it would be a spiralling effect, losing each industry one by one. Wheat takes around five to six months to become ready to pick from the moment it has been planted to the moment it's harvest for retail. The wheat harvest has to be done quickly and effectively to reduce the risk of damaging the wheat from strong winds and rainfall. Wheat needs to be modified to help the growth in supplies and to keep the nutrients the wheat withholds. And knowing the importance of wheat, there has been more research into genetically enhanced such crops as cereal crops and def defend against diseases like rust, crow what, and barley, yellow dwarf virus. With the right information into how to stop these Diseases and tire crops and farmers would not suffer from these vast losses. Also, research into how to create a grain that is high yielding will also help with the high demand and costly prices. Without these amazing agricultural providers, we would struggle economically. Plant science into how to provide the much needed grain has to be taken to make sure that we can stay on top economically. Ask yourself this, how long could we live internationally without our leading grain?